Prince Harry has been urged to explain how he was able to enter the United States and obtain a visa despite admitting to take drugs such as cocaine, magic mushrooms and cannabis in his memoirs, fair and promotional interviews. The Duke of Sussex, who relocated to California with his wife Meghan Markle and their young family in 2020, has been advised that he should be totally transparent over his visa application and how he answered the questions or risk becoming a political pawn. Under U.S. law, anyone applying for a visa to live and work in America has to tick a box to answer yes or no to the question, are you or have you ever been a drug abuser or addict? Tune into our Royal Family Snapchat show, every Monday exclusively on Snapchat in the past celebrities such as Nigella Lawson and Amy Winehouse have been denied entry to the U.S. after admitting to taking drugs on their visa application. U.S. immigration authorities now have until April 12th to respond to a Freedom of Information FWA, request filed by leading American think tank the Heritage Foundation, which is seeking to determine how Harry managed to get his visa. Senior lawyer Samuel Dewey told the Mayo on Sunday, it is in the public interest to know how Prince Harry answered the drug question. If he has been honest and open about his drug use, and there is no reason to believe he has not been, it could well be that he ticked the yes box, in which case he would need a waiver to be granted a visa to be admitted into the states. That means he would have had to be interviewed in person and someone would have had to grant him a waiver. We are simply asking who granted that waiver. See below for live updates on the Royal Family 41.